So, welcome back. Uh, March just messaged us. No, I'm Pom Pom. Yeah, you totally look like Pom Pom. All right, stop kidding around. There is something important. Uh, I suddenly remember that uh, there was one thing that caught my attention during the trip, this trip to Low Fu. Uh, that matrix of uh, per uh, Perseus Ultima at the Divination Commission. How did you remember that name? I have no idea. The Master Diviner used that thing to interrogate Kafka and so right into her memories without Kafka even saying a word. So I was thinking, could this matrix be used on me? It's worth asking her. We might even be able to find your lost memories. Yes, yes, I want to ask the, the seed of divine foresight, but after thinking about it, I felt a little uneasy. The low Fu had just experienced a huge incident, Jin is injured, and the master divine needs to manage the whole place. I couldn't bring up this personal matter, so I thought I'd wait till she wasn't so busy, and, that, uh, and then we could go to the Venetian Commission to get her to ask her. Okay. We'll go meet... We'll go meet with March. Oh, group, ch group chat. What the fuck? <laughs> We're jumping to so many things. What's this group? Uh, why is there a group chat? What do you want? Um, you probably guessed. We want to ask you for your help. Uh, help with what? Can you please come to the Bellabog Museum finishing room? Uh, we can have a chat there. Okay. I'll be there. But first I have to help March. Brother, what the fuck happened here? Let's see. We'll do a single wish on her. She's preservation. Oh yeah, she's preservation. Let's do it. No. 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 Yes. No Fusheng. But we did get links! Woo! We have a healer. We have a new healer. <laughs> ah, single wish links. Perfect. Perfect. This patch again. Dispatch again, dispatch again, dispatch again. Let's see. Why is she so adorable? Uh, stop looking at me, Link. Wh what's up with the... <laughs> She's adorable. I have a light cone for her. <laughs> Equip. I have a light cone for her. <laughs> enhance. Auto enhance. Go. Yeah, go. We are at pity 50. I guess we could do one more wish 10 just for fun. Oh my god, I, this is going too far. Okay, we stop here. <laughs> Level. All oh, right. Why are you so sad to see me? Oh, and I need to figure out relics for her too. Okay. Let's do one more wish wish 10. Now. 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 Yes. That's pretty 60. I kind of wish it was Fusheng. Too bad. Is my is my Pela already? Yeah, she's full. <gasps> that means. Oh 
Fuck yes. No, I want to hold back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now I want to hold back. Because I already have this light cone. I already have it. I kind of want to get this one, right? But Himiko is no longer my strongest. I kind of want to get this one, but I don't know when I will get wealth. So I kind of want to hold it off for wealth. Okay. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. She asked first, so we help her first. One zero one. Z yeah, yeah. One zero one zero one one zero one zero one one zero one. Shut the fuck up. Fushing. Good Sup, morning. girl? Is work going well today, Master Diviner? I am extremely busy. Oh. If you have something to ask of me, do not delay. Uh, you were about to say something along the lines of, How did you know I wanted to ask something? But then you remembered who you were talking to and decided not to bother, correct? Why would you say that? Well, the look at her face says it all, doesn't it? A face is not a reliable instrument of divination. On the contrary, I run a dozen hexagrams before I even get around to breakfast. The results are never far wrong. Today's hmm. divinations threw up some unexpected complication. The hexagramatic position was facilitated between the water and heaven trigrams. The matrix of prescience gave the following interpretation. You will have three uninvited guests. This is ultimately auspicious. Oh, come on. Ultimately auspicious? Wow, sounds pretty good to me. Seems like we really were destined to meet today, then. You know, I see you've been using... Bruh, I don't believe in destiny. ...to divine into Kafka's past. Well, I have a similar request. Hmm, I see. You wish to use the Matrix to relive the past and awaken parts of your memory? Viable in principle, but whether the Matrix is truly capable of achieving this result remains to be seen. Well, we can check. I knew it. Things are never simple, are they? We can check. We, 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 we can try. Mouse. Mouse. God damn it. This mouse eats batteries like a motherfucker. Wh who said that? I didn't say it was impossible. I said it was viable in principle. There is a gap of a million light years between impossibility and viability. I feel I must explain in detail the principles behind the Divination Commission's ultimate weapon to avoid any misunderstandings. The Matrix of Prescience does not allow one to remember anything. It merely collects data in order to infer past events, in the same way that future events are inferred. Just as realm-keeping commission officers collect ballistic evidence to recreate the scene of a crime, there are materials from which we can infer the past. These may be items related to the experience or memories of the people involved. Miss March's predicament is very different from Kafka's situation because she doesn't remember what happened in her past. I am no medical professional, but fortunately, I'm very fond of breeding. We understand that there are two types of memory loss. One, where the memories remain dormant, floating around in the unconsciousness, unable to be awakened. And another, that involves direct erasure of memories from the brain. Direct erasure. So, hmm. Something must have happened when I was frozen in the ice. 
I bet the memories were freezing and decided to hibernate. Why don't we try using the Matrix of Prescience to determine which situation pertains to Miss March? Let's begin then by preparing the requisite inference materials. Miss okay. March, your memory is unreliable. To guarantee the Matrix's accuracy, you'll have to provide something related to your past experience. Anything will do. A lot of ice. When you're ready, come and find me in the Matrix core. A lot of ice floating through space. That's all we got. Said I need to provide something from my past experiences. What should it be? How about a Sienjo souvenir? That's... How is a Sienjo souvenir supposed to be from your past? Girl. Girl. Do we speak the same language here? Or is there some sort of a barrier that I'm unaware of? Like, it. it what the fuck? What? Nope. There we Oh, fuck. Gotcha. I'm such a genius. Oh my god, I'm such a genius. Okay, we did 20 wishes today. I shouldn't do more warps. So, Fushang, you didn't come to me in my in my warps. So, what do you want now? Have you acquired something from your past? As a nameless, surely you must have souvenirs from your journeys that could evoke memories. I've got lots. It's just I don't know what to choose. Uh, a ticket stub from the express. Ah, proof that I boarded the express. The conductor gave me this. Memories from the Astral Express? That should do the trick. Sorry, my cup's kinda leaking. That should be enough. Uh, a March unapologetic smile is displayed on the permit. The note uh, also re oh come on the vague recall the research level that starts with two the only very of this uh, permit open is that leads to the bathroom. <laughs> Something related to your work. Good. Oh my god! <laughs> I love the idea. The only pass they gave March was the bathroom one. <laughs> We can just keep lost items to return to the wildfire. Uh, they've got loads of it down there. I just chipped off a tiny piece. <laughs> I can understand the young girl's fondness for glittering gemstones. Oh, come on. A uh, cap of immortal delight. My fondest memories on the Sienjo. Bitch brought Boba tea. Oh, she's such a basic white girl. She's such a basic white girl. Miss March, are you not able to provide possessions from before you lost your memory? Uh, before I lost my memory? So, something I don't remember getting? 
Even then, I couldn't be sure it was from before I lost my memory, right? No, she has a point. Strange to you, but to infer the past, I need materials that were pertinent at that time. Could you try recalling some memories again? Uh, from before the memory loss. I have this big old passed. dildo. <laughs> I'm sorry, Master Diviner. When Himeko found me in the ice, I was stark naked, like a newborn baby. I didn't have any items with me. Well, something new we learn. No, I don't have any of that ice lying around. It melted away not long after I was rescued. Fair enough. Oh yeah, you sure are a smart cookie. My six-phase ice ability must date from before the memory loss. Master Diviner, any ice I create should do, right? It should indeed. I'll have someone place the material in the base of the terminal, the Matrix. Miss March, please position yourself in the Matrix core. We may begin our inference whenever you are ready. We're getting so much lore on March, but at the same time, like, it's understandable. This is a quest to figure out March's lore, so... <sighs> ah. I, I don't know what I wanted to say. <laughs> I wanted to say something. The Matrix has clear diagnostic. Miss March, are you ready yet? Uh, I'm pretty sure I should be. Almost kinda ready to go. Okay, start. Slaps butt on the back of Fushing. Memories are suitable for reawakening. People carry with them much pain and suffering. Oh, I wanna see it all. We can pause the inference process. I would never wish for good intentions to result in harm. Nah, bro, go. I'm okay. Let's do it. Do it. The only way to find out is to give it a go. Yes. Very go. Well. I will soon connect you to the Matrix of Prescience Ultima, where the Matrix will read your memories and guide you back into your past. Fuck yeah. Let's if go. If you reach a block in your memory, the Matrix will use the data gathered to derive a scenario and construct a possible past for you. Possible past. It. So it's not even real past. Oh, um, it's possible past. Can join me too? I'm sorry. Eh? That would be highly inadvisable. You form the nexus of the Matrix's inference. She would only introduce redundant data to the system. Hmm. In other words, inside the memory palace that the Matrix constructs, the only person you'll be able to count on is yourself. Yeah. I can do it, March. Don't worry. I can communicate with you from outside the Matrix and manipulate the recollection process to a certain extent. Ah, good. Let's begin. Oh. Hmm. Well, she insists, but since she's preservation, we can throw these two in, I guess. Where is she? Let's go, Shan Sulo Fu team. Whoop whoop. No. Oh. I was kinda excited to walk around that version. The Matrix of Prescience has reconstructed your past. Before you is a space generated from the memories and items you provided as raw materials. No, oh, that's me and Welt. Are you okay, Miss March? No. Uh. I'm feeling a little dizzy. Uh, my head is spinning. As expected. Most individuals feel nauseous after being presented with the dizzying excess of information provided by the Matrix. Oh, th th there she is. Uh, not, not you, Kang. Well, Ting Yun. Must be seeing things. Why are there two Fushens here? Your eyes are working just fine. One of the Fushuens is a projection of me which allows us Fushuen. to communicate with each other at all times. The other Fushuen indicates that I existed during this part of your experience. They start what? talking. <laughs> it looks like the healer's market. 
that's moments before that, that's not long before this uh, thing you dies this must be the time we broke into the alchemy commission makes sense really? oh, that can't be right i remember there were lots of cloud knights in the plaza well this is just a matrix inference remember distortions are possible although the scale of this distortion is surprising try communicating with a fushuan you see over there we should hear what the master diviner has to say wow calling herself like that <laughs> i love they're looking at each other the Celeron crisis, we must refine the question. What is the crux of the problem? Generally, it is believed that when one seizes on the crux of a problem, the problem will split open like bamboo on the edge of a knife. Uh -oh. Nobody could have foreseen the catalyzing effect of the Celeron and the Ambrosial Arbor. As the ancients said, blessings bring about misfortune and vice versa. Nature has its own algorithm. And it is precisely when fate wins betwixt blessing and misfortune that I, a master diviner of masterful proportions, am called on to save the people of the La Fu. What the heck is she talking about? Master diviner, did you actually say that at the time? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck was that speech full of your ass like? It would appear that in Miss March's estimation, I am somewhat of a blabbermouth. You do talk a lot. <laughs> Despite the obvious distortions in this experience, the base materials from which it is composed are taken from your actual memory. There is no falsehood here. In other words, your subconscious mind thinks that I talk in tongue twisters. <laughs> Girl, <laughs> wow. It's like someone reading your diary that right now. Oh my god, I have to talk with everyone now. Now is not the time for losing one's temper. If okay, Cloud the Trainer. experience is distorted, we should focus on filtering out each distortion one by one. Otherwise, we won't be able to trace your memories back any further. Um, this is getting a little complicated. <sighs> Draw your bow and fire an arrow at that Fu Shuen. Oh. What? Well, fuck me, I guess. From the boat. It came together. Together as one. Just a scratch. A blade knows no mercy. Your end approaches. Fuck. Rules are made to be broken. Oh really? As easy as that. A quick divination. Converge and awaken. That paradise may be unsavor it for me. I don't really know how to use Fushuan. As easy as that. Oh come on, dude. Suddenly deciding to fight me. Now let's see who's here. Ching Yun, well, General Ching Yuan, and also her. Her. Uh, I don't have to I'm a her. Of them, right? The Master Diviner was easy peasy, but I don't think I could take General Ching Yuan. Easy peasy? <laughs> the interference factor creating the distortion here Oh my god. For sure it is. The person present who shouldn't be. Ah. So I have to pick someone and clear them of interference? Exactly. 
My perception will disappear for the moment so as to not cloud your judgment. If you can hear my voice, then it means I'm watching over you. Okay. You're the best, Master Diviner. <laughs> I hope the best version of me can overwrite the gloriously absurd version that lives in your subconsciousness. Oh my god. <laughs> She's so... Person who shouldn't be. Who could that be? Okay. Well, I think, like, that's enough for the moment. I'll see you all. See you all next time. Bye.